What is up guys, it's Awana Turtle. Today we have a different Yu-Gi-Oh opening. We are opening up a box of Duelist Saga. Uh, I kind of just saw this on a pretty, um, on sale for pretty cheap, so I did pick one up. There's only three packs in here, so this will be a very quick opening. Um, and there's nothing too insane, nothing game breaking to find in these uh, packs. However, it does have like a lot of nostalgic stuff. They kind of say has new cards from every show. Well, that's a pretty cool way to open the box and uh you know not that i've seen every show but uh as far as good hits it has a lot of classic nostalgic cards uh you know blue eyes i think one of the bigger hits is that black luster soldier um apparently there's something called the effect veiler which is actually a really good card and uh yeah so nothing no home runs but just a lot of uh i'm hoping to find some nostalgic cards so stuff from um the original Yu-Gi-Oh series gx and that's kind of where i dropped off and if any of the other series are actually really good and definitely worth watching, let me know in a comment below. Um, I personally am someone that likes, appreciates the game. So one thing that I do want to see is like something that actually follows the rules and none of this like, oh, I'm just going to do this because random reasons and then I win. That's not really, it's not really for me. So let's get into our first pack. Ooh, some elemental heroes of Legacy of the Hero. Return two fusion monsters from your graveyard to your extra deck. That list the name hero in the materials. Draw that list the hero. Draw three cards. Wow, that's quite good. Wonder if that's banned. Depth shark. Otherwise, that make element to heroes pretty good. Depth shark. Not familiar with this guy. Diamond dust. That's a cool name. Reminds me of Shiva from Final Fantasy. Ooh, cyber dragon. This must be a pretty good hit. Um, the cyber dragons was always a cool archetype in the series in gx and then a hero lives and more gx support or more gx cards so that's a pretty cool card and then cyber dragon your opponent can if your opponent controls a monster and you control no monsters you can special summon this card from your hand that's the one thing about cyber dragon he was level five he was five stars um despite kind of like having the stats of a four star i'm not even sure who that is on the pack i was curious if if what kind of pack art determined what shows you get the cards from but that doesn't seem to be the case Legacy of the Duelist. Not sure what that's from, but looks like Blue Eyes and Dark Magician. Dark Summoning Beast. It's kind of hard to see that. Saber Shark. I wonder if this is a Mako card that I'm not familiar with. DD Warrior Lady. A lot of these. I think DD stands for Dark Dimension. And then, ooh, Imperial Order. I remember this card. Um, was this from Pharaoh's Servant or something? Negate all spell effects on the field. Uh, once per turn during your standby phase, you must pay 700 life points to keep this in fact. So this negated all the spells. Um, you could use Jinzo to negate all the traps, although obviously they don't kind of go hand in hand. Jinzo will kind of negate Imperial Order. But uh, those are kind of like the control things from back in the day. All right, we're already on our last pack. So yeah, these these go, go through quick. And it's only five cards, so... Let's hope for, yeah, let's get one of those Effect Veiler or that Black Luster Soldier. Let's see, we have a Light Wing Shield. Can't really tell what's going on there. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. Full Armored Crystal Zero Lancer. It's a numbers. Well, not a number, but a XYZ. Vision Hero Vion. Actually, I feel like this, this guy rings a bell. I'm not sure why. Rescue Cat. This is one of the better ones, I believe. Look at that, that foil pattern. It's kind of like its own thing. It's very different. Rescue cats. Uh, the font is too small. And then Royal Decree. What is this? Negate all other trap cards. Ah, okay. Oh, nope. Still doesn't work. <laughs> Royal Decree is the trap version of Jinzo, I guess. So, there you guys have it. A very quick opening. Um, pretty cool set. Uh, a lot of different cards. I feel, yeah, again, nothing nothing too crazy. Like, no no huge home run hits. Um, we got a cute little, cute little kitty to show off. Uh, to show for our time um yeah let me know what your thoughts on this set are and if there's if there's a big card that i'm not aware of let me know in a comment below but uh yeah thanks for watching this quick video um and uh definitely support the channel by hitting that like button subscribe if you're not already and yeah we'll catch you guys i'm a water turtle and we'll catch you guys next time peace